In the second print of the suite, called The Holocaust, we come to the killing, and that's the actual historical event that, of course, after the beginning of the oppression, we get not just oppression and people fleeing the oppression, but we have the actual killing. It's somewhat ambiguous whether they're lying or whether they're in coffins or whether these are doors, but the point is that you have people who are in and stacked the way bodies head to toe were, were actually stacked to save room, chillingly enough, at the time as an historical event. At the same time, he continues his story within this dance of the bodies. And you notice that in the center we have this figure rising and making a bold gesture here and pointing to his left. What we also notice in the personal story, and, and it grabs us, uh, is they're looking directly at us. And we have these gestures of the, the foot poking up here, and we have a hand raised here, and a hand pointing. We have all these pointing, signaling gestures as if they're signaling to us. And we can't escape that. We can't evade the stare. We can't evade those gestures. And it begins to dawn on us that maybe we're required to respond.